the idea for this painting came through my friend Kilian so Kilian has been uh, a friend of mine since ever since i moved to zurich he's one of the first friends i made and we've been pretty tight ever since so when he asked me to make a painting for him i was quite excited i really wanted to make something that he finds relatable and he feels happy to hang on his wall so i decided that i will gift him something for his birthday i didn't know uh what exactly but because Killian uh, does a lot of things he uh, runs triathlons he has a startup um uh, and uh, he loves mushrooms and he has cats he plays soccer there's so much to his personality that uh it was hard to pick a few things but i ended up picking two uh two things he loves mushrooms and cats so he has two adorable cats named sir edmund and kebab um <laughs> and uh he loves mushrooms as well uh he has grown mushrooms actually uh there's one time he fasted for 7 days and he invited me for the dinner when he was breaking his fast and he made these delicious um uh, uh like fried mushrooms like uh, almost like a fried chicken it was uh, absolutely delicious so i knew i wanted to make something using these two concepts for him and then was a lot of trial and error of looking at what kind of mushroom what kind of cat how would they interact how would it all uh, get in place so first was i think the choice of mushroom uh, i think in my mind i always thought i would paint a rachella mushroom uh, something with a bright red cap and a big stalk and then okay where does the cat go around the mushroom on top of it would the be cat would the cat be eating the mushroom and then uh, i knew within a few minutes of thinking honestly that this cat is got to be taking a nap underneath the mushroom you know ever since i saw mushrooms my first memory actually of mushrooms these little um, tiny umbrellas just the size of your pinky uh, they grew uh, in the front yard of my house in india and imagine i imagine like me as a toddler would go and observe them and when i asked my mother uh, and my grandmother what it was they said uh, it they are in and i it's in marathi they said uh, kaula chichatri which means uh, crow's umbrella so my first ever connotation of a mushroom was in the form of uh, an umbrella and then it was just uh, putting it all together thinking about um uh, how how more about how they were interact and it just made sense that the cat would be curling around the mushroom and a lot goes behind these paintings uh before and after the video so before the video i made a small sketch in my notebook to see how this idea would play out and i realized that had the mushroom which looks more like an actual rachella um might not fit does it doesn't quite have that umbrella imagery i wanted so i changed the uh, the mushroom a little bit and added more definition to the cat but i was pretty happy with the initial initial um Uh, attempt and also after the video was done and i had recorded everything i realized that i actually uh, wanted to add a, little, a few more touches so i uh, in the final painting i added uh, more red to the ear and the nose of the cat that made it look like it was dreaming about the mushrooms it was guided by and sheltered by this mycelia that actually we all are sheltered and guided by and um so it was just poetic for me to have the the red also be reflected in the nose and the ears of the cat uh, unfortunately it ha- i got this idea later um right before i gifted the painting to kelian <laughs> so i don't have it on record but you know these paintings they just never get over do they